the incredible geocliffs of Nazca cover 37 miles. They are among archaeology's greatest discoveries due to their quality, nature and size. The geoglyphs depict living creatures, men, plants and imaginary beings, as well as geometric figures several kilometers long. The startling feature of the NASCAR geoglyphs is that they can only really be appreciated from the air, making many people question about how and why they were created. The NASCAR lines number in their thousands, and the vast majority of them date from 200 BC to 500 AD. The earliest lines created with piled up stones date back as far as 500 BC. Studies have shown the Nazca people were an ancient prehistoric culture that was successful in using engineering techniques. The figures come in two types, bimorphs and geoglyphs. The bimorphs include around 70 animals and plant figures. That include a spider, a hummingbird, a monkey and a thousand foot long pelican. They are grouped together in one area of the plane and archaeologists believe they were constructed around 500 years before the geoglyphs. There's around 900 geoglyphs on the plane. Geoglyphs are geometric forms that include straight lines, triangles, spirals and circles. They're enormous in size. The longest straight line stretches an incredible 9 miles across the plane. The lines were made by scraping away the reddish, iron oxide covered stones that cover the desert surface to reveal the white sand beneath. In most places, wind, rain and erosion would quickly remove all traces of this within a few years. At Nazca though, the lines have been preserved because it's such a windless, dry and isolated location. Although these lines were first discovered by Peruvian archaeologists, it was not until the 1930s when air traffic in the area increased that the lines became widely known. From the ground you can't make out what these creations are, but when you see them from the sky you can understand their size and beauty. This recent giant figure was found and recovered by archaeologists, but they have said it's in danger from land traffickers who have surrounded the area and prevent access to tourists. The orca is one of the most mysterious and ancient drawings of the Nazca field, and it took 50 years for the Peruvian state to recover it when it was already lost. The creation depicts a huge drawing that was engraved on the hillside. The orca is a cetacean that inhabits all seas of the world. Is the apex predator of the ocean. The geoglyph of the killer whale was photographed in the early 1960s and was considered to have disappeared when it was identified and rescued by a team of archaeologists. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.